Thousands of rockets launched from Gaza into Israel sent millions of Israelis running to shelters off and on throughout the day. Adele Reamer, a resident of Kibbutz Nirim near the Gaza border, describes what happened. After at least seven hours of being locked down in our safe rooms, the idea finally arrived and started going through the, the kibbutz house by house, bush by bush. They have to clear everything out. At a party in the forest near Gaza, Hamas gunmen on motorcycles opened fire in all directions. Several dozen Israelis were taken hostage and brought to Gaza, including women and young children. A spokesman for the Islamist Hamas movement said the Israelis are being hidden in underground tunnels inside Gaza. A Hamas spokesman said the attack was in response to what it called the desecration of the Al-Aqsa Mosque and an increase in Jewish settler attacks on Palestinians. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu warned Hamas that it will pay a price. Since the morning, Israel has been at war. Our first goal is to clean the area from those who have infiltrated it and to return security and quiet to the areas that were attacked. The second goal, at the same time, is to exact a huge price from the enemy. Israel launched a series of airstrikes on Hamas targets in Gaza and cut electricity to the densely populated strip. Linda Gradstein for VOA News, Jerusalem.